So the first thing we want to do here is we're going to go to File and open our model. Um, here you'll need to find where that model is. Um, I'm going to go back over here under my computer. Then we're going to go to Local Disk C. Here you'll find OpenSim 3.3. Models, Gate 2392 SimBody. And again, Gate 2392 SimBody. Um, you will not see this. This is something I'd put in later trying something else. Uh, but this is what we want Gate 2392 SimBody and open. And that gets us our person here. First thing we're going to do is rename this. Okay, we're going to rename this normal gate model. Then we're going to do a load motion normal. Okay, if you can't see your person, normally it will go up here like this. All you got to do is arrow down with your arrows on your keyboard. Um, after you've clicked on him. Get him centered in the screen here. Uh, up here, you can either turn this repeat on or off. If you don't, it'll run for about a second here and stop. If we do repeat, it'll continue to run so you can see this normal gate for a longer period of time. Now the next thing we're going to do is plot. So we're going to plot the gate. Here we want our Y quantity to be muscle tendon length. The muscles, Simitin R. And our X quantity is normal gait. It's going to be down here at the bottom. Here we want to put normal gait or normal and add. Okay, that's going to give us our plot. Now the big key here, do not exit this. Leave this open. So I'm going to go back over here and click off of it. Now I'm going to do a open model again. I'm about to go up one level to get back to my gate 2392. I'm going to put that one in there. I will then click on my new one here, rename it to Crouch Gate model. I'm going to load the motion of crouch 4. That'll line them back up here. Again we can see the side by side here. Uh, we'll, in a minute we'll link these together but as you see this one's the different gate. Now we want to go back down here at the bottom and open up that original that plotter we just had. So we have normal gait already there. Now we're going to add Y quantity, muscle, tendon length. Muscle, same thing. Simitin R. Forgive me if my pronunciation is incorrect. X quantity. Now you'll see crouch. And we're going to say crouch gait. Add that. And now we've got the nice overlay of those two. Uh, you can export this image. Uh, to, I'm just going to put it on the desktop. I'm going to put it in my other file here. Um, I need to save that as uh, gate plot. Then I can go out to my desktop. It up and now you can see that also outside of the sim program uh, so you can see that plotting so that's how you do that last thing after we've got the plots we can now open up motions so if you have these collapsed you need to expand them open up expand the motions do that for both 
hold control, click on both of them, right click, and sync the motions. Now, when we play these, they will walk side by side to give us a nice visual representation of the different gates uh, being represented here.